Wild to Beauty and today we are going to talk about wigs. Yes, wigs. Why you need them, why they're so trendy, comfortable and affordable wigs only on this channel. Get comfy, get cozy, because I am going to talk to you all about wigs. Whether you have never worn a wig or if you're a wig aficionado, you've got to check out the video. So thank you for watching and let's get started. So there's a couple of things when it comes to wigs that I didn't think about until I got this one. I'm gonna share the company information and everything with you. But when I got this wig, um, I was really, really blessed instantly. I've had it for two months. It still looks absolutely amazing. It's lightweight, it's comfortable, it's trendy. I think I look really cute in it. I hope you think so too. Um, you definitely would as well. Um, and so I wanted to just get the whole experience of this wig before I brought it to you guys. Um, one big thing was when the company came to me and asked me if I wanted to review the product and so on and so forth. Um, I had to check out and make sure that they had a broad, um, they, they catered to a broad audience because I cater to a broad audience and I don't ever want to bring any kind of product or products to you guys that you can't go out yourself and purchase. So, um, the first thing was to make sure before I made this video was that I took the time to investigate where and be able to relate to why someone who has decent hair, I have decent hair. I don't have the best hair. I don't have the worst hair. I have decent hair. Why somebody with decent hair would get a wig. Um, how this wig made me feel. Um, how this having a wig could help you at times where you didn't even think about it. Even past holidays, even past birthdays, you know, what this wig has meant to me. Um, and how I have been really, you know, thankful for it. So first thing that happened when I got this wig was I had a Zoom call. And the Zoom call was not expected. I had 15 minutes to get ready. So it was getting my hair done or fixing my makeup. So I didn't have time to do both. So I did quick makeup and I grabbed this wig. Now I'd worn it before, so I knew right when I got it, I knew how to put it on. I watched a bunch of YouTube videos on how to put on wigs because I'd never worn one really the right way before. There are right and wrong ways. You can wear it however you want. But I wanted to make sure that I, um, I tried it on, that I played with it. I didn't know how important it really came into play when the Zoom call came and I needed to take it. Thank God I was prepared and I had worn it before. So you get that. So Zoom call. Second thing was there was a recital we had no idea about and I had to be there. Again, makeup or hair. I know my hair is pretty basic, but I haven't had my highlights done in a long time. And you know, it was pink if you watch my channel. And so it's just, you know, when you're around a bunch of people and you don't have time to really look the way you, that you want to look, you know, um, a baseball cap, I could have thrown a baseball cap on and gone and that would have been fine. I had this wig. It saved me in a way that I just can't explain. Then I had a special event to go to. It wasn't that special, but a special event and my hairstylist couldn't do my hair. Um, she's very good, very, very good. She's very booked. I'm not going to anybody else. So my choice. So um, the wig came in handy then. So we're talking three times. Um, then I decided, well, I didn't wear the baseball cap this time. I'm gonna go shopping and I'm gonna wear the wig. And I'm just going to see how people kind of you know, um, are receptive to it. And, you know, people were like cute haircut, who does your highlights, just all kinds of compliments that I always get with my hairstylist, but with a wig, I didn't know what it was, but they're so on trend and so acceptable. Not that it would matter to me. I'm still going to wear it regardless, but it was just funny to see how, um, I get a lot of comments and compliments when I was wearing extensions earlier on when they were popular, but the extensions that I have are clipping. And so they clip the hair and they pull on the scalp. I'm not worried that my hair is going to fall out. 
Um, you would be if you're wearing like regular extensions, but it's just by the end of the night, my head hurts, like my skull, my scalp, it hurts. So um, I was really, I got nice compliments on them, but they were natural hair, they were heavy, um, and they um, honestly did not even hold up like the synthetic hair has, which is really weird, because most of you are gonna say, oh, real hair, well, not most of you, some of you will say real hair is the best, and there's no argument one way or the other. For me, this just like came in handy so many times. So then I needed to make about seven videos in one day. And I was like, I'm not loving my hair and I haven't had my hair done. So when you're making videos or when you're on Zoom calls or when you're in meetings or when you're going to events, you really, it doesn't matter who you are, you don't have to be making videos, but you want your hair to look good. And now I understand why all of these people, all of you wear wigs because it's not only like very, very, oh, what's the word? It, it's extremely helpful by getting ready, but it's so, it makes you feel so cute, like a different person. And I don't feel like, you know, I have to run to my hairstylist or I don't feel bad now making videos if my hair doesn't look perfect, which it looks fine. You guys are amazing. You've never said anything to me about my hair or anything. I wouldn't ever say anything to anybody else if their hair, if their roots were like this long, it's not like, oh, you have obviously not been to your stylist. But the thing, what it comes down to is, it just not only came in handy so many different times, it became what what else could this do for me? So what else this can do for me is it's gonna change up my looks, it's going to change up through content, and it's gonna make me feel um, like fun and like my hair is not flat by the end of seven videos it's going to feel like the same and cute and then I can do my makeup for you and I can do all kinds of things without worrying about messing with my hair and that's kind of the same for you if you come home from work or you know you whatever it is and you just want to look cute or change something up or look you know sexy or fun or whatever you know putting on a wig is like cool so that's why i'm saying you might get one or you might get 10 after you see this video because they come they come in handy now if it wasn't lightweight and it wasn't comfortable and it was hot and i was sweating because i got this two months ago when it was really hot where i live then i wouldn't have this video for you um the way they make this they put a lot of the hair here I'm not saying there's not a lot of hair in the back, but if you're really worried, depending on why you're needing a wig, if you're really worried or just, you know, the time or season it is, um, if you're really worried about wearing a wig that's gonna make you hot, they are not making you, they're not making hot wigs. They're not like just chunking out the hair like crazy to where it's not breathable. Now I wouldn't suggest a 28 inch long wig for someone who is hot all of the time. I would suggest a cute wig, which they have so many that are shoulder length or just about here that are gonna be totally breathable. Um, but then they do have the sexy long curly wigs. Not that this isn't sexy, it's sexy, but you get what I'm saying. So without further ado, on amazon.com, the company is called Calis. So Calis offers 100% premium hair, synthetic hair wigs, fashionable, lightweight, natural, and comfortable. And I promise they're comfortable. So it comes in this packaging. This packaging is genius, okay? It's resealable, so you can put your wig back in its net in here and you can travel with it. The other thing is they put the style of the wig on the packaging, which is extremely important. This is a 12 inch synthetic ombre ash blonde wig. Now, if they couldn't do more for you, they give you the hair care instructions. And this is so important that they did this because they offer, like I said, different lengths, different textures, different everything. So every wig is going to have a different 
hair care instruction. If you don't keep this, it probably will say it on the website, but I suggest to keep this because you'll know exactly what you can and cannot do with this wig, meaning can you wash it? Can you dry it? Can you use a blow dryer on it? I think this one says I can wash it, but I can't use a blow dryer on it. I I would imagine because it just re-waves up, but I'm not gonna wash this and I don't, I mean, I don't need to. And um, I'm not gonna put heat on it because, you know, synthetic hair, you don't wanna melt. So they do that care instructions. Amazing. If they didn't do anything, more. If they didn't go anywhere else and they just gave you this perfectly, they decided, listen, we know Lauren is going to have a special event. And we know this is probably her first wig. So in every wig package, they have two wig caps, which is amazing. Now you're never going to wear it this low. Okay. You're always going to have it up high and the little clips that are here or uh, little combs here can go up in here if you want it to, to help it stay so it's not sticking in your hair. But this keeps your hair under control in and under your wig. So they thought of everything. They knew that you weren't gonna have one probably. They knew that you weren't gonna know what you could and couldn't do with your wig. So they put everything on the packaging. So Calis, great job amazing job thumbs up you did a great job putting all of this together i couldn't think of anything i would even add because when you go on amazon.com they have videos they show you how this is constructed on the inside obviously not going to take off my wig but when i get more what i will do is show you the inside you're going to be looking on amazon.com after this video how they're constructed on the inside Super comfortable, super affordable. I can't say enough about them, you guys. Check them out. Calis Hair Wigs. Beautiful, beautiful. I know you'll find something you want. I found a pink and blonde, a blonde, and then there's one that is really intriguing that's like blonde and then ice blonde tips, you guys. I mean, gorgeous. And that one. I want to say is under $30 as well. And they're so affordable. So, um, you guys, if you do get one from amazon.com and they have a comment section, uh, cause I don't know if they do or if they don't just let them know you saw it on how to beauty. I don't get paid, um, for this, but it would be nice to see that you guys are, you know, taking some suggestions or that I actually helped you out. So have a fabulous day. Wherever you are, whatever day or night or time it is, the day or night. And um, think of Calis, think of the wig, think of how it might save you in certain situations that you might have not just had time to do because we all deserve it. No matter who you are, you deserve to feel cute and special. So thanks for watching and have a fabulous day or night.